using my mic. Good. Bye. Sorry, let's go that you find out now. <laughs> I'm going crazy. I'm hungry. She said word for word. Good morning. Oh, that was like a nice morning stretch that I just had. Okay, so it's Monday, March 30th. I live in New York. We are locked down. I don't even know at this point. Like all non-essential businesses are closed until April 30th. We're supposed to be social distancing and like staying six feet apart from everybody. I don't know. I'm leaving the house. So this video is going to be a week in the life during quarantine, which I'm sure none of us have really gone through before. At least I haven't. So let's get into the video. Say good morning. Are you acting shy? Okay. Do you want to say hi now? <gasps> wow, okay. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. You all know the deal. Perks of living with a hairdresser. We're taking out my extensions with baby oil. Obviously, you're supposed to use extension remover spray, but we don't have that. So we're using baby oil and taking these out because they're very overdone. And then I'm going to give my hair a rest for like probably a month or whenever I can go back to the salon. And then other Brie will put my other extensions back in. If anyone was wondering how you actually take the extensions out. So basically, extensions are put in like sandwiches, like pressed together. So she's just pulling them apart. And then my real hair is in between that sandwich. So that's what's going on right now. Cookie, I just said show bite. Show them? <laughs> so mommy's taking this out. Who's knocking like that? I don't know. Very aggressive knock. Are they at the door? It's UPS. We're still going. This is what we're working with now. Goodbye hair. After hours, CDs came with our ticket. Hi, my sweet babies. So I was on the phone with Paul for like an hour sitting in my bed doing nothing. This is the quarantine fit. Just joggers and my dad's sweatshirt that Paul bleached for me because my dad got bleach all over it. So I was like, give it to me. We're not throwing that out. So then Paul just like made it look cool. But anyway, it's Monday. So Monday, I have to edit my videos. Monday, Tuesday is editing. The only days that I don't edit is Wednesday and Sunday when I post because I give myself a break. So I'm gonna do that. Usually I would work out and then edit all morning, but I just really didn't want to. And you know, it's quarantine time. We can take breaks if we need to. Like if I feel like I need to take a break, I'm gonna because I have all the time in the effing world right now. So I'm gonna edit, but I don't really know when I think I want to eat a little bit more because all I do is eat let's go eat probably an apple because that's what I'm in the mood for right now and then I'll start editing but my extensions are out and my hair is feeling so good just so real and silky and great I got my cold apples only with peanut butter and my YouTube I'm gonna watch YouTube until I'm done eating my apple and then after that I'll start editing all right guys so I just edited a bunch my lips are like going through it once again so just ignore it I don't know why my face is Red, lots going on, lots going on. Me and my fam got swell taco. So I'm gonna go downstairs and eat my food. But first, I just wanna give a shout out to my sweet fan pages right now. These are just ones that I know of. So if I left any out, I'm sorry. The first ever fan page that was made for me and Brittany was Mooney Girls fan page. I'm gonna put screenshots of all of them on the screen. Mooney Girls underscore fan page. And then I don't remember the order from then. That it's Mooney. That one was an OG too. These are all OGs because this is just getting started, but hello. Calm down, the food here. Amazing, bye. Full of hearts, Mooney. Mooney sisters, Mooney loves, and Mooney's angels. Make sure to go follow all them. They're the sweetest ever, and I'm so thankful to have fan pages. I never even thought this would happen in my life. So thank you guys for your dedication, and I love you, and now it's time to eat. Oh, just stunning. I miss you, swell. Look at how... Stunning. It's currently 9 p.m. I'm gonna have some water with apple cider vinegar and honey and then I put it in the microwave and it's so yummy. Cheers. Good morning. Oh, it's 11.25 and me and Brianna are about, hi P. We're about to start our Pilates workout. Ouch! Ouch! It hurts. Come on, 
Damn. Now that I'm half dead, I'm having my yogurt. Tomorrow's Wednesday, which is one of the days that I post. I post Wednesdays and Sundays. A lot of people still ask me that. I've been posting Wednesdays and Sundays since the first day of January. But anyway, I didn't get much of my video edited yesterday. I got some, but not enough. So I'm gonna finish my video. I hope it doesn't take the whole entire day. And then, I don't know, I'll probably cook because I don't have anything to eat for dinner tonight. Yeah. It is 5.52 right now. I finished my video. It just uploaded onto YouTube, so it's gonna be all ready for tomorrow which is such a good feeling and i have the rest of the night to clean my room because it always needs to be clean and do whatever i want make dinner whatever what do i do do i just put in the garbage Brittany is making a cake and um she cracked an egg in the wrong spot i don't know what happened there ronnie can you explain to them for me can you say tomorrow's Gigi's birthday my Gigi's birthday and say we are making arts and crafts for her Classic. say arts and crafts Open for Gigi. Please. For her birthday. So tomorrow's Graham's birthday. So I think I'm gonna make her something too so for funsies because she loves arts and crafts. And like we can't go out to get her anything. We're gonna get her like gift cards and stuff at like CVS, but that's the most we can do. So we're being little again and making arts and crafts. Okay, so I'm making Graham a huge birthday card. Didn't write in it yet, just finished the writing. Not that good, but that's all right. It's the thought that counts. What? <laughs> He's supposed to be on a diet. Well, what did you just? That, look at that. Brittany just made green cake. It's not Listen. even that good. Not her fault. The brand just isn't good because you bought it. But now you're eating it. I would have polished this off. I would have ate this. I would have had ice cream. Look at this, guys. Come on. Feel bad for me. I don't Stop. feel bad. A squirrel would eat more than this. He needs to be on a diet. Not because we want him to get skinny, because we don't care about that. But for health reasons. I'm good, y'all. I'm good. Yeah, you're good until you're not. How to say it. How to say it. Hi, guys. It's currently 1.45 a.m. It's April 1st. It's Graham's birthday. I'm exhausted, and I miss my boyfriend. I want to just have a sleepover with him. I'll see you guys tomorrow. We'll be having some birthday celebrations, quarantine style. Good night. Hi, angels. So, it is 1 o'clock, April 1st, Graham's birthday. She's 78 today. I woke up this morning at 10.30, got up, went on the bike, obviously said hi to Graham, you know, gave her her car. She loved it, by the way. Ate breakfast, took a shower, and now I'm here with my wet hair. I don't really know what we're gonna do today. I know we're gonna order in because... Graham's birthday, we had to do something. And I woke up this morning just feeling really not motivated to work out, which I hate feeling like that. Especially when you work out at home, it's so easy to just say, eh, I'm not gonna work out today. But what I do is I just get on the bike or get into the garage, whatever I'm doing that day. I just do it, you just have to do it. So I got on the bike and I did do 45 minutes on the bike. So once you start, you're gonna finish, you know? So you just have to get yourself to do it, like no matter how you feel. And I don't know why I'm telling you guys this, but hopefully that motivates you in some way. Yeah, so that's all I have to update you guys on right now. I'm gonna go downstairs, hang out with Graham a bit. Peace for now. We're literally just sitting out here, getting the littlest bit of sun that we possibly can, but there's like nothing else to do. Like I don't know what else we can do at this point. It's been almost three weeks now that we've been inside. The birthday girl's over there. Pee Pee just laid out on the rocks. How could that be comfy? But I can't imagine it being comfy, Pee Pee. Hi. <laughs> Okay. Oh, pee pee girl. Hi, birthday girl. How does it feel to be 21? Not bad. Getting a little older, but you know, 21, I'll take. What are we getting for dinner? Crazy shack. <gasps> no? shack. Shake shack. Shake shack for anyone who is wondering out there. Shake. Chef. I just made Brittany and I my fire salad for lunch. I really was gonna go for grilled peanut butter and fluff and then the fluff was expired so I was like you know what that's a sign I should be healthy and then I was craving crouton so I was like salad it is. Tell the camera what you want. I want salad. This is the only baby that I know that begs for a salad. Say cuz I'm a vegan baby. That's cucumber. You want a cucumber? Cucumber and red pepper. Cucumber and red pepper, go ahead. 
That's all I'm good for. And then he's gone with the wind. We're having a nice, peaceful dinner while Brianna has a Pilates class. Graham, what did you get for your birthday dinner? A hamburger, french fries, mm -hmm. and a shake. Sounds good to me. Delicious. I got french fries and a chicken sandwich. It's nowhere near my Chick-fil-A, but it's good. This is an ideal way to do Pilates, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Tell her what to do, baby. Literally everything is closed. Carvel was closed, so my dad ended up going to Baskin Robin, and this is the only cake they had. Look at how small this is. We have nine people to feed here. Happy birthday to you. Hi, it's nine o'clock. My lashes are looking a little crazy. They're starting to get there, but that's okay. My health is more important than my eyelashes, right? What I'm gonna do is re-rate my calendar because it's April 1st and there's gonna be literally nothing on the calendar at all, but might as well pretend like something's gonna happen this month. All right, I'm gonna redo my calendar and I'll probably see you guys tomorrow. It's 9 p.m. right now, so I'm gonna be doing a whole lot of nothing. Watching more YouTube in my bed. There's really nothing exciting going on, but you guys wanted a week in my life and this is all that I can bring to you right now, so I hope that it's good enough. I'll see you guys on April 2nd. I'm losing it. I miss my boyfriend. Good night. Mwah. I love you guys though. I'm going crazy. Hi guys, it is finally Thursday. This hairstyle isn't looking as cute without my extensions in, but that's okay, we're gonna make it work. Right now, we're just getting ourselves together for another morning Pilates class, because what else is there to do? Tell the camera that you're gonna be joining us for Pilates today. Pilates. Say, so we're doing Pilates with our bands. Pilates with our bands. What color is your band? Green. What color is Cookie's band? Blue. And what color is Mommy's band? Yellow. You're so smart. Can we take a picture Together. Smile. I use blue. Got it. That was literally so hard. Now I'm having my yogurt. We did something called the crazy eight. So you start with, you do eight movements, but you'll do one and then you add one. And then you do those two and then you add one. And then you do those three and then you add one until you get to eight. It was so hard. And I was craving this yogurt the whole time. Oh, what is going on? So I took a body shower, put my hair in this little bun. I'm trying not to wash it as much because why wash your hair when you're not gonna see anybody? You know what I'm saying? I'm wearing this adorable adorable set today. This is the first time in a while that I've like looked cute. So my sisters and I are gonna go to this little marina beach thing by us because we just want to like get out of the house somehow and like not just go for a walk like leave the house because I haven't done that in so long. Oh we want to get Starbucks. I haven't done that in so long. After when I get home, I'll be editing my life away because I have to edit Thursday, Friday, Saturday in order for it to be up on Sunday. So I have some free time now. And then later tonight, I'll be editing for a long time. We literally just waited online at Starbucks for like 20 minutes. But like, what else is there to do? So who cares? But obviously, drive through. We're not allowed in, not that we would ever go in. It's been so long since I've had this masterpiece move out to body. Okay, we're making some TikToks. Brianna just called me ugly and fat. <laughs> made that up. <laughs> I made it up. But I told her every body type is worthy of life. 
and um you are completely <laughs> just making this up no she we told me i literally weren't even speaking about any bodies. anything fat or bodies like no no she told Bodies. me that i would look i literally can't see this on the mat she told me i would look ugly with a septum exactly. piercing and then i said so would you and she said no i would look good and i said i took a picture of myself and it looked good well that's a filter in real life you don't have filters she's calling me ugly. am i wrong yeah but i don't think i'm ugly <laughs> she never called me ugly. <laughs> People tell me I look good with my nose pierced, but I'm not getting pierced. You wanna know why? I don't want to Because she's too perfect. Uh, she doesn't want to ever go near her face because she's too perfect, she told me. Those words have never came out of my mouth. The only Even reason why I don't want it is she because She literally said face. word for word. I am I so perfect <laughs> that I cannot get my nose No, she said word for word. I have the face <laughs> of an angel. <laughs> So if someone exactly. would want to like bring me to the plastic surgeon before they get their nose done You wouldn't want that I to be in the way of how yeah, perfect right, right. my nose is and like sculpting it Well, so It's time to brush my teeth. Anybody who gets Bath and Body Works hand soap. Rose Water Ivy is the best scent ever. They have it in a candle. I think they have it in lotion. I don't know. I probably would have got it if I saw it. But bro, the candle and soap, it smells exactly like rose water. Like my brothers like this. And they don't even like perfume. Oh my god, it's just so <laughs> Ew. I'm so sorry if you're watching this and you think I'm a normal person because I'm not. I'm sorry, but it's better that you find out now rather than like years on. I don't even know what time it is, but we're brushing our teeth so we can sit in our beds and edit all night. I said I was going to edit all day after the beach, but then I end up taking Instagram pictures. Here it is. Go like it and follow. I ended up just like having fun with my family. I think it's like 8.30 right now if I had to guess. So for the rest of the night, probably to like 12, I'll be editing. So better than nothing am i right i'm gonna brush my teeth and get ready for bed and i'll probably see you guys in the morning peace and love to you tomorrow when britney joins us for our pilates class that she's never done she's going to die but i'm excited i'll see you then good morning from me and my pilates instructor britney was gonna do it with us but she bailed of course Hey guys, so I took a body shower again because why am I washing my hair for no reason when I'm just gonna put in a bun to work out tomorrow morning, you know? For real this time, I'm gonna be editing the rest of the day. It's 1.45 right now. So hopefully I can finish this video by the end of the day and if I don't, I can finish it tomorrow and that will be Saturday and then I'll upload on Sunday. So I'll see you in probably like five hours. What is up? It is 11.30 at night. I don't know when that happened, but it did. I only got about five minutes of my video done. And it's probably going to turn out to be like a long video. So, therefore, I got really not much done. It's really, really easy to get distracted in my house. Like, really. So, I made brownies. I'll insert clips right now. Look at how gorgeous they are. I decided midway that I was going to put Oreos in them. And then I stuck them in the oven. And then couldn't wait to cut into the brownie. Took a picture midway. Ate it with ice cream. And it was delicious. Anyway, tomorrow, could you guess what we're doing in the morning? Could you guess? Yes. Pilates, everybody. And I'm so excited. I need to edit for literally the rest of the night. So that's not fun at all. But, you know, I do it for my, my people. You guys need a name. What do you guys want your name to be? If you are watching right now, comment down below what my subscribers' names should be. What do you guys want to be called? What should we call you? Because you're so more than just subscribers. You're my favorite people. And my sweet friends. So let's think of a name. And I do want to give a quick shout out my bun right now. I do want to give a quick shout out to all the essential businesses that are open and working during this time and a 
especially nurses, doctors, anybody in the healthcare industry, truly anyone that has to work in general, my heart goes out to you because it's a scary time to leave the house in general right now. My heart and soul goes out to the healthcare workers. You guys are risking your lives, your family's lives every single day to help us, which is unbelievable and so selfless. And I think they are our heroes. Grocery store workers, you guys are killing it. I just want to thank everybody around the world that's doing their part right now, even if you're just staying in the house like I am. I know I went to the beach to walk around, but it was like a private area and we didn't touch anyone. If you need a sanity stroll, go for a sanity stroll. Just stay away from everybody and literally be as clean as you possibly can. But anyway, you should be proud of yourself if you're doing your part in social distancing. You should be proud because you're doing a lot for the world right now. So I love you guys. I hope you're staying very safe. We're gonna get through this together. I know right now is a time of uncertainty and none of us have been through anything like this before. I mean, at least I think. I know for a fact we are gonna come out of this and once we come out of it it's gonna be such an amazing feeling and I think it's gonna change a lot for our world I think we're gonna become I think cleaner people in general I think handshakes are gonna be not used as much I don't know I think things are gonna change but I think everything is gonna be okay if your family was personally affected by this I'm so sorry my love goes out to you and just know I'm praying for you it's time to edit good night <laughs> Oh my god, this video is getting really repetitive. I took a body shower again. Didn't wash my hair again. Worked out and did Pilates again. And guess what I'm doing now? Editing again. So, um... <laughs> Hope you guys are enjoying me doing the same thing over and over because I'm going absolutely insane. <sighs> it's Saturday and I have to get this video done but it's taking forever still on the first clip it's been two days i'm losing my mind so i'm literally dedicating my whole entire life to this video right now and i will see you guys later hopefully it's finished i have to post it tomorrow bye guys i'm like drained from editing my lashes are looking a little busted i don't want to see any comments about them because i'm staying in and not getting them done Anyway, I'm like exhausted from editing. Even though I sat on this bed for like the entire day. It's 7.30 right now. I need to update the software on my computer. And it took me way too long to edit that. Way longer than it ever should have because it was being very slow. I'm like mentally exhausted because of that. I miss my boyfriend. That's all I have for you right now. Hi. There's nothing going on for the rest of the night. There hasn't been going on. What? Okay. Um, not English, but whatever. There hasn't been much going on for the last three weeks. Focus on me. Hello. I'm the YouTuber, not the chair. I'm sick and tired of staying in my house and I want to see my boyfriend so bad. But I'm not going to until I don't know when. I don't freaking know. I don't know when, how long it's the last. I don't know. I love you guys. I'm probably going to go downstairs and chit chat with my family. I'm excited that tomorrow's Sunday and I won't have anything else to do or plan. Tomorrow will be fun because everyone will be home. I'll see you in the morning. No Pilates tomorrow and I'm so... So thrilled about it. Good morning, everybody. I have nothing to do today besides post my video. Sundays I post. So here's what I'm doing. Eating my yogurt while I watch YouTube. I did have hot lemon water before eating this, which was fabulous. And now I eat. Not really much else to tell you. I'm just doing this. Hi, guys. I'm about to film a jewelry haul on my channel. I got all the jewelry sitting in front of me, so I'm gonna do that right now, and then I'll get back to you guys. What is good? It is Sunday night at 12 in the morning. This was my first week in my life. Obviously, if the circumstances were different and life was at its normal pace right now, this vlog would have been a lot more fun and entertaining. I don't know how it's gonna turn out until I finish editing it. That's always how I feel about my vlogs. I feel like my videos suck until I'm done editing it. I'm like, oh, when did that get funny? Let me know if you liked it in the comments down below. It was a lot. I don't know if I'm ever gonna do it again. I probably will if you guys like it because I'll do anything for you. I know there's a lot going on in the world right now and I know it's really scary, but I hope that I can bring you some joy in this uncertain time. Follow my Instagram if you want to keep up with my life and add me on Snapchat. And you can follow me on TikTok as well. It's always down in the description. I love you guys so much. I know I said that already, but I really do. You guys are the best. Peace out.